guys, okay. welcome to the channel where we become the best version of ourselves. In this video, I'm going to take you through a 10 minute beginner friendly ab workout. So you're gonna follow along that with me and we're gonna get strong abs and defined core. So I hope you are ready. Hope you enjoyed this workout and now let's get this started. So the first movement, we're gonna do plank toe taps. Make sure to keep your butt low, squeeze your core while also keeping your legs straight. You can also keep sliders underneath your feet if you want this to be harder. Next up are V-ups. Make sure your back is straight so that you don't injure your back and your elbows are not flaring out when you're supporting yourself. After that comes leg drop. Make sure your entire back is pressing on the ground. Keep your legs straight and alternate dropping each leg onto the floor. The lower you drop the leg to the ground, the harder it is going to be. But make sure to not touch the ground. After that comes the side toe touches. You can also lift your upper back off the floor into a V position just like what we did before but it's gonna be harder. For this one, I'm going to do be doing a beginner movement. But yeah, it is totally going to burn. I know your one side of abs is burning guys. After that, we move on to the side toe touches onto the other knee. Then we do the elbow touches, touch your elbows to the knee, and when you move your leg away, make sure it doesn't touch the floor. It's going to be harder if you keep it low to the ground, but not touch the floor. Next up, we do mountain climbers. Make sure your shoulders are directly above the palms and you climb with your legs facing the opposite side of the body. Try to keep your back straight and keep your butt low. Wow, I know this was killer. Now we're gonna do side planks. Make sure you're squeezing your core. This will totally burn your obliques. Now we repeat it onto the opposite side. After that, we're going to burn the core with bird docks. 
Lift your arms up and the opposite leg. Squeeze your glutes and your core. Try and make sure that your core and your butt doesn't move while you lift your arms and your legs. Now we repeat it onto the opposite side. It's that time that you got caught, you snuck out and forgot. Your parents were so mad, but man, she was so hot. That time you got too drunk, the first time you blew chunks. It's okay, we all drank too much when we're too young. The first time you held hands, your first time in romance. You thought you had no chance, but still last her to dance. That time that you moved out, your parents were so proud and waving goodbye. They now we do a similar movement, touching your elbow to the opposite knee. Crunch your core in and feel the burn in your obliques. Now let's repeat onto the opposite side, feeling the burn in your obliques. I know this is hard guys, but we are over halfway done. Now let's repeat with some more toe taps, but this time make sure you lift your body up the floor. Your butt will only be the one landing on the floor. Let's repeat onto the opposite side. After that, we do the ab bikes. Try to lift up your head on the floor and touch the elbows to the opposite knee with some power. Real good power. This will definitely make it harder. After that, make the legs in a tabletop position with your leg underneath the knees parallel to the floor. Try and touch as farthest out as you can with your hands. I know your upper abs are crying at this point. Next up, we do some reverse leg crunches. Put your palms underneath your lower back so that it doesn't put, cause a strain on your lower back. Now last but not least, Let's do the leg drops again, but this time focused on one side at a time. For the one leg up in the air, make sure to keep it straight out. I'm trying my best as hard as I can, but I know it is tough. It is burning, guys. And now let's repeat it on the other side. Okay. 
Woo, we are done guys. I hope you enjoy this workout and I will see you on my next video.